How many times you wanted to turn on or off a lamp and you had to drag yourself from the couch to do so? Whether to read a book or just to find your demo sleepers in the dark. Today we are going to use this little device right over here, Shelly 1L and 2L to automate our light switch in your house. You will be able to turn on or off any lamp using your smartphone, set shadows to turn lights on and off wherever you are and still use your original switch just like before. We have used quite a few Shelly devices in the past but today we are going to use the Shelly 1L or 2L and in your case if you go to your switch and you only find two wires one of which is a live wire and the other one is the switch wire which means that we don't have neutral. Most of cases this happens and the solution is right here. If you are not 100% sure of what you are doing don't risk yourself just hire a professional that can do this simple installation for you we are touching with electricity components it might be dangerous this is not a tutorial it's just me sharing my experiences with you first i just go to my circuit breaker and i switch off the lightning circuit then i remove the face plate and also the button from the light switch and after taking out the two screws i can access the switch itself now in my particular case you can see that there are only two wires the live wire and the switch wire so there's no neutral and that's why we are going to use shelly one L or 2L. So let's remove both wires from the switch. Let's connect the live wire to the L terminal on the Shelly 1L and let's connect the other wire which is the switch wire to the O terminal on Shelly. Now let's create two short wires to reconnect the Shelly to the switch. One wire will go to the S1 to the switch and the other wire will go from the SX on Shelly to the switch. And that's it, simple as this. Now I just need to place the Shelly inside the wall box, screw the switch back in place and put the faceplate and button back. But before we turn on the power back on, let's go to the ceiling light. We will take the light protection and this will depend on the kind of lights that we have. We just need to find the wires that will go to the lamp and we will find the neutral, live and ground. Now we just want live and neutral so that we can install the Shelly bypass which is included with Shelly 1L or Shelly 2L. There's no particular order, we just need to connect these two wires, one with neutral and the other one with live. And now we are ready, you can just close everything back up and go to my circuit breaker and turn it on. Now once I pick up my phone and open the Shelly app, as usual there will be a new device show up automatically which is Shelly 1L. I just need to follow the steps in the app and in about two or three minutes it's fully set up and ready to use. I can now turn the light on or off just by using the app. I can turn it on or off using the original wall switch so nothing changes there. I can also set shadows like having the light turn on when you wake up or off when it's bedtime and of course I can control it while relaxing in beds or in the couch I just need to tap the button in the app and that's it. So it's awesome, really simple to use and easy to implement. And for those that are looking for a solution that has no neutral, the Shelly 1L or Shelly 2L is the answer. Now the example that you just have seen was with Shelly 1L, but if you happen to have a double switch, then the Shelly 2L is the way to go. In terms of the installation is exactly the same. The only difference that we will see on the 2L is that it has more connections so that we can wire to the second switch but it's the only change everything else is as simple as the 1L I will leave a link down below for Shelly 1L and Shelly 2L at this time you can get 10% discount directly off the link but Shelly's birthday is upon the corner so for the next few days just pay attention that instead of 10% you will get 20% direct discount just following the link hopefully this video was helpful in some way and if it was don't forget the usual thumbs up right over there which is really appreciated on this side of the screen my name is Roberto George and as always I'll see you on the next one